I love bees. Hi guys, this is John from Look Adventures. Welcome back to the channel. Um, today we have a film for you um, about the stingless bees of Costa Rica. Um, there are some 60 uh, varieties of stingless bee in Costa Rica, about 600 I think in total in the world. Um, but the particular bee, uh, stingless bee that we're going to be talking to you about is called the Mariola stingless bee. Uh, which produces the finest quality honey with the most incredible taste. So I'll leave it there just for a second. I'll let you um, have a look at this little bee and I'll come back to you with loads more information. I love bees. Buzz, buzz, busy bees. Good for you and me. They're good for you and me. Making honey from flowers, plants and trees. Oh, I love bees. I love bees. Buzz, buzz, busy bees. Hi guys, um, you're probably wondering how I've become involved with bees. Um, we're very lucky to have extremely good friends who are building a house, uh, a home in Costa Rica, um, and have decided that they would like to have bees on that site. So they've decided to go for this stingless um, variety of bees, of which, as I say, there are 60 in Costa Rica. Most of those are endangered or under threat. And like I say, they've gone for the Mariola stingless bee, um, which is about three millimeters long, very, very small, tiny little bee, uh, which produces the highest quality honey with an incredible taste. So we started with one, which was uh, bought in Costa Rica, the hive was bought in Costa Rica um, and was put on a plinth which we made and has been sitting there for about 18 months or more, um, quite happily. Um, we then decided that we wanted to go on from there and a bee house has been uh, made where a further nine hives will be placed, which I'll show you in due course. Um, which will mean that they will have 10 Mariola bee hives on their site. So I'll come back to you shortly with more information. So we're very lucky that we have um, a very skilled guy um, here who um, has built the, um, the bee house um, you can see that he's done all the uprights which have been concreted in. Um, there's going to be room for 10 hives within the bee house. The roof, as you can see, has been thatched, but with an artificial thatch, so it won't, it won't rot. Um, and we won't, hopefully we won't get too many things living up in the roof. Um, what else is there to say? The base is, um, has all been welded with... Uh, steel and everything else and then uh, eventually we'll have um, decking material um, put across it. So it's a, a really nice home for the bees, they're well protected and they're not going to get too much heat but they'll get enough, they'll be protected from the rain um, and the hives will eventually be um, secured down so they can't be knocked off by anything trying to get at the honey. So that's the end of the first part of the um, B film. Um, there is going to be a second part. In the second part, um, I will be showing you how we collected the honey from the original hive, uh, which produced the, I think it's 16, 14 or 16 little jars of the Mariola honey from the bees. Um, there's lots of very interesting things there, so I hope you enjoyed the film. If you do, can you please like and subscribe, uh, and you will then get the second film, or the second part, which will be coming up very soon.